yo 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 i'm gonna get told off around my tune though aren't i yeah all right hey everyone so we are in oh well, on the way back from birmingham and uh we thought we would got an hour on the trains and thought we'd kill some time and do some images i've seen just found an app basically where i can go through images and things on my phone and uh yeah we thought we'd do a chat while we're on the move um unfortunately it's not live which um you know, is one of our kind of funner ways to do it and we do get a lot of fun doing that so sorry about that people who are the regulars watching and uh, you just have to deal with um, not being able to pos participate this time well and, you can uh, talk to each other not being able to um, <laughs> not being able to correct us when we're wrong <laughs> so, which is a plus this is a real big plus for yeah, us obviously. So, uh, we're yeah. right more on the, these chats than we are on the ones that are live well normally the live ones so I, I, I normally look at the comments to um, to make it sound like I know what I'm talking about so yeah you make me a better presenter. Me. Make me a you better make, me. You make me a better man. <laughs> cool. So what we're going to do is um, we're going to go through some stuff. So obviously there was the uh, the opening of the... Sorry, we're wrong. Yeah, we're on train. So obviously we were, we were going through the um, images um, of uh, the TK opening. So Toys, uh, Toy Kings opening. Uh, we got a few videos, so we're going to go through video-wise. Uh, probably post the videos later on separately, maybe put some really bad music on like I normally do. Um, and then, you know, we'll go through that way. Also, we're going to go through the images that we have uh, on here for the last week. Probably going to miss some because, again, we're on the train and I think I've got some on my laptop. But anyway, um, so yeah. yeah, let's go. How have you been this week? Yeah, it's good. It's been a good week. Good week. Yeah, good week. How's your collecting nice. been this week? My collecting's been good this week, yeah. I've, but I'm broke. I'm, like, I've looked at my bank account and just made me want to cry, so I'm drinking water. Well, yeah, I've got pieces being delivered, but annoyingly, I've been off, like, I've been at home for, like, the last month, and then the day I'm going to go is the day they want to deliver stuff, <laughs> so it's not always the way. So, yeah, I've got a delivery coming on um, Tuesday in my house, which is um, uh, lovely. So, yeah. Um, all right, what we'll do then is we'll get straight on to the pictures. So let's see what's up first. All right, so let's go through the pictures first. So we've got 146 images to look through and um, start off with the first one. So this is uh, such a cable. Actually, I did get sent a picture of this um, quite a while ago yeah, when, I was, when I was in Sweden. Yeah, a long time. And I'm not sure if the artist meant to send it to me because I think he think he, kept, I think he thought I was like another artist called Alex because on Facebook Messenger they took away the surnames. Oh really? So it ends up having just like your your uh, your first name on there. So he may have thought I was another more sculptor, important than what you are. Well, he said that. And he, more trustworthy than you. Well, are. he did say that. Um, you know, I, I I follow your work and stuff like that, and I doubt he means I review. <laughs> so, <laughs> but he said it a while ago, and kind of out of respect, I'm not going to forward. Yeah, uh, well, you haven't. You've been good about it. No, You've I'm, been good about it. Fair play to you. I didn't even forward him to George. I just basically waited for him to come around the house to show him because I don't trust him. Um, well, that's a lie. Don't look at me like that. That's well a lie. <laughs> that's <laughs> the biggest lie you send me loads I of I don't, send, I don't send you anything. Lies. Play along, fucker. Jesus, mate. So talk about this. What do you think? All right. Well, the um, the cable. Let's start. Right, let's start down low. Apparently on this one. So you, a few people didn't know is that there's the portal uh, with the dead ball hand coming through the little uh, kind of beanie baby. It's the part I like, dislike the most. Actually. I don't mind it. Does nothing. It doesn't bother me in the slightest. And then also, then you can't really see it. Yeah, here, that is. A, yeah. But there is um, someone outlined it and changed the uh, uh, the focus. Yeah. And uh, there is actually a Deadpool outline on the flames. But it's really hard to see there. Really, yeah. Really, really hard to see. I should actually turn off my, uh, my thing here, shouldn't I? So, uh, how do we do that? Go on that one. And where's the aeroplane? There you go. There you go. All right. Should so, have some peace and quiet now. Hopefully. So yeah, apparently there's a silhouette. Yeah, I can, I can see. That. I can totally see that. Yeah, definitely. Well, I did when they that. changed the. No, I can see context. it there. It's definitely there. Um, I mean, there's a lot of. You know, you can see the Deadpool like sort of. Yeah. Belt yeah. and everything across the the, the middle there. Yeah, that's great. Yeah, and then also, I mean, so on the back to the cable. Um, there's a lot going on there. This is more the kind of life, life lifestyle. Yeah, the like, first the first, the first cable, first of the creator. Yeah. yeah, he's definitely like a shade older, definitely an older version than some of the modern stuff. He looks in his fifties at least. I do think his uh, shoulder pads are a bit too big. And it does then make his how uh, life will drew him though. His head how, look a bit like a pin. That's how life will drew him. I mean, it is very a accurate to that. My problem is, is that this is a classic cable, and that 
like Deadpool is more of their modern chemistry yeah. and it's just about 15 years out of time yeah. um, because when this Liefeld cable was in comics Deadpool was a different character and he they really didn't have a relationship overly so I d you know that 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 Deadpool and Cable thing came in like 2004 not in sort of 91 when Cable came into like New Mutants yeah. I think it's just a little bit of a money grab that that just add in that which yeah. is a shame because I really don't think it's necessary the portal looks massive though you can see it right up the back of his arm there no 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 that's a glow to his gun is it yeah yeah that's like a glow on his gun I think that's part of the portal no mm. looks like that portal look go across it looks like it goes oh, all the way up oh. Make it smaller there, look. Yeah, yeah. Like it goes, oh, yeah, it looks like it goes all the way down there to the portal. See that all the way across? Mm, maybe. The gun's blocking it, but that's how that portal looks like it's a decent size. Yeah, I don't think it is. I think it is. But again, I mean, if it's going to be like a TV little bit of piece. a proportional issue with this piece anyway, in terms of the size, the size of the thighs and the legs and things. It's, yeah. it's a bit. It might be the angle though. I really like it, the, the, but this what bothers me is the Deadpool part because Cable don't need Deadpool. You know, it's a good enough character on its own. It don't need that. It don't need that. Well, it it be, cheapens it. It cheapens the character there. It's going to be an exclusive, and you can take it away if you hopefully want. good. Um, this is just about. This is about pop culture shock. Just complaining about people doing negative um, comments on their on their group. Um, I do agree with an element of this. I agree with the fact that um, if you have a group like uh, Sideshow and you have a group like Prime One and a group like Pop Culture Shock, people shouldn't bring their customer service issues to the group. It should go through the correct channels. It should be that people post their damages through the correct channel to get a replacement. And it shouldn't be that people go this week to try and go to, to get that approach um, but it's an open forum man no, you, are, you, you can't you can't shut down what you don't no, no, want no, to say but it is negative like negative comments as in um, I don't like this or don't like that it shouldn't be yeah but listen we we are, we do videos right yeah we do videos we do reviews we can't stop people from trolling we can't stop people from giving a shit you open the door yeah sometimes you're going to get shit come through it trying to control that it just looks like you're trying to dictate it just looks like you're trying to dictate how your group is what it's going to show and how it's run and you're all you're gonna get all you're gonna get is shit for it it's so, behind it. thank you thank, no, thank you you're welcome this is uh, why we don't do the live the live chats together yeah i could just spit all over <laughs> myself gonna I mean, I, you're fucking you already got me earlier so don't even complain what, one time out of ten visits Jesus yeah. man <laughs> <laughs> I think you I think this is a little yeah. bit for me I, I think it's a little bit petty and I think that you can't control this you're just gonna have to rise your chin above rise your chin up and just get on with it but I, did, look, I honestly think they like, have if, a they have no, a point but it's an open forum people I, can talk I think if I received a piece from Sideshow and um, a leg was broken or whatever on a piece yeah if I then go to the Sideshow forum and say this is my broken piece blah 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 yeah i shouldn't really do that i should go through the correct channels first yeah but sometimes you're pissed off and yeah, you want no, everyone to see what's going on yeah but you know and they've they've somebody sent you something it's meant to be perfect it's not you're pissed off how, how, what you you meant to just talk to customer service at the end of a live chat it's not always easy and sometimes you get bad news so you're going to come straight to here and and and, and throw your dirty laundry about that's what's going to it's just going to happen trying to control it is is, is never going to be ba well, no, banning and blocking is, people if you're going, no, if you're you're going more trouble. like okay th this piece is broken fuck sorry show fuck pcs fuck pro oh, yeah, 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 of course blah. and then you send your request off to them and then they go okay we'll send you the replacement then you come back going oh actually they did it right yeah, well, yeah you've already done the damage yeah i agree with that yeah but that's not really what this is about is it no we know but this is a bit of that as well anyway this is a bit too long i do i do think you should go through the appropriate channels i do agree with you this is a bit too long for a uh, train journey uh, <laughs> um next piece this piece is obscene this is the uh leon no, it doesn't matter no, it doesn't matter. no, no, no. Uh, this is the Leon, and this is uh, uh, a one of a kind custom piece. Looks and amazing. This <laughs> looks obscene. It looks like literally it looks, looks like it does look like him. It does uh, look so much like him, man. It's crazy. I mean, like, there you go. That's just madness. What scale is this like? This is a core scale. It looks quite big. Like the head in there. Yeah, it looks quite scale. big. It's amazing. Really well detailed. One of a kind, Eleven thousand dollars if you've got the money. For a one of a kind, that's not crazy. No, no. But and also for that quality. Oh yeah, is it silicone? Silicone again? I don't think it is. 
It's amazing, man. It's just amazing. This looks so real. Oh, wow. Glasses. They're wow. Repairing those beast ones. Yeah, there's a touch, yeah. <laughs> That's amazing, man. Yeah, it's uh, ridiculous. Like Eleven thousand dollars is a little bit out of my price range, I'm afraid. Yeah, but you know when you think about it, it's what people just paid for like a grey Hulk. That ain't a one of a kind. Oh yeah, this is better. I mean, like, well, yeah, it's better than that. It's <laughs> not that bad. That head is better than that whole piece. <laughs> <laughs> so you got that? We just obsessed with the artists. Whereas you got there you go. Oh, Mad. What an amazing job. What a talent. And he's done looks it, like real hair. It's all plucked yeah, in the like hair. Like Leonardo mad. DiCaprio as well from. Uh, Julia, is it who's this Ru- Russo? No, Jean Russo? Jean Russo, yeah. Reno. 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 Jean Reno, yeah. Uh, so you got that. Then these are the pieces from Infinity Studio which are on their way, so this is just an update. Um, really nice. This is the one that comes with the poster yeah, backdrop. Beautiful dragon. I actually thought this piece was bigger because it had a lot of presents when I uh, yeah, saw it. Doesn't some look massive it. there, does it? No, no, it's not. They also did the. Um, the other one, I think it was called The Journey or something, which is crazy as well. <coughs> yeah, yeah, lovely that. Great, Infinity Studios are putting out some really great pieces. Um, and I've always had a bit of a, get a bit of a hard on for dragons. Oh yeah, I love, love a bit of dragons, me and all. Uh, then this is right up my alley, and I'm, I'm very tempted to order this. So, so, <laughs> see, so. Oh, well, well done. <laughs> Bless you, man. Sorry. So this is actually oh, the uh, <laughs> this is like the lonely Jason, and this is like a little cute kind of SD uh, Jason from uh, LB Studios. With loads of cut up limbs in a bucket and a piranha. So basically, oh, that's like, uh, like, go back, go a couple. I'll go back to this way because I've got to go backwards because uh, so it's, it's like that where he's fishing. So he's got a little fishing line, a little uh, hand, and then you got like a piranha going oh, that's for him. A minute, so. And then there's a piranha under there going for the hand. And then you got the light, and you got all the bits in there. That's, uh, that's really a, lovely. That. And, uh, then you got like that, which is the um, this is uh, part three, I think. And uh, there you go, the water. That's crazy, man. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I think I'm gonna buy this. This looks so cool. It's like wicked, it's like really like wicked detail. How much is this going for? Um, I think they told me it was uh, three hundred twenty dollars to get shipped. Wow, that's not bad at all. Yeah. So I'm definitely going to buy that one, but it's small. It's uh, I think it's about thirty centimeters tall. So that's about not really, inches. Yeah, that's not really. Small. Uh, one of the detail, one man. of the justifications I've got for getting is I have the the chubby dog You have to. The chubby dog So I've got the uh, oh, yeah. Wolverine and the uh, fat pole. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So Why that's what well, I think. It'd be a bit smaller, but I think it could. Go it's along really with those. cool. Yeah. Um, these well, are then well, well, more of these later though. This is the Queen Studios T one thousand. Uh, Robert Patrick, this, these are ridiculous as well. Really uh, beautiful. These are silicon. And uh, I'm not really sure how long. Uh, don't age well, does it? I don't know. It's really Nothing hard. that was old that was done in silicon that was impressive at the time yeah, looks any but, good now. But quality, quality changes over time. Yeah, it improves. There's materials no doubt about improve. It. Yeah, there's no doubt. It's apparently done by uh, medical grade silicon. So it's like oh, a brand called uh, Platinum Cinnamon. C- cinnamon? Platinum, platinum Silicon is made oh. from. And it's meant to be the highest grade, allegedly. So yeah, really, really cool. And um, go along then, this is the Audi. Do it. Why don't you do it? I don't know why you cry. <laughs> <laughs> and, but it's uh, something I can never do. Yeah, this is, well, these are insane. And really? It's like collection, that, that Aussie guy. Yeah, it does actually. Maybe, does it? Maybe, maybe it is his. Yeah. Amazing. Yeah, these are crazy. There's more of these later Amazing on. Amazing work. Uh, we'll come back to these later on at the con, but these ones. Also, Queen Studios are branching out, and they're doing these little cute SD pieces as well. So this is the joke. Really in at the minute, isn't it? Yeah, it's really popular. So I don't know the price of this. They wouldn't tell me. But, uh, yeah, Why? They didn't know. Ah, okay. Yeah, they were still deciding. So these have been released in China at the moment, and they're hoping to get worldwide license from Warner Brothers for them. So really cool really cool little pieces like loads of detail going on and uh, because of uh, people have space issues and price issues obviously you know they're going to want to uh, this looks fantastic though really you know, really like stuff. got a lot of character this sort of stuff got a lot of um, personality well I, I had a phone call with uh, Queen Studios about something else the other week because uh, there was a thing about licensing and stuff I just wanted to go through with them and uh, when I did they mentioned that they were doing these smaller scale pieces and the way they described it is I thought they were going on to kind of like a, a Funko Pop way uh, and I was just like oh, you know um, you know um, oh, what's that company that do the one tenth pieces uh, on the studios yeah, yeah. 
Fire Studios branched off into that, blah, blah, blah. Yeah, you know, yeah, yeah. There's a big, big market, but yeah, it's, good. it's a big crowd here. Yeah. And then I saw it and I was like, oh, this ain't like a fucking fun coach. Yeah, it's nothing like that. This looks great, this stuff. Yeah, I'm really, really nice. nice. I'm happy, to, really looking forward to seeing that line uh, yeah. increased, um, expanded. Yeah. Uh, oh, God. Hate like this. A, yeah, this is a uh, kind of random, kills everybody. Um, looks shit. Yeah, this is by. Um, Zion Art and, um, Is that what that is? Is yeah, Zion Art? Oh, uh, that, that looks terrible It's funny that Because usually his stuff Actually looks really good Until it's painted And then It sort of takes a dip The yeah, paint usually the you, paint things, Yeah like, the factory paint The sculpts, paint, are, really the sculpts nice, are amazing then, uh, On their stuff I mean that's quite disappointing What for, you should for, do is You should usually, probably focus usually, On making kids Yeah that would be a good idea In fairness um, cause, yeah. And then also This is uh, a tease for an Iron Studios Thanos. I don't know whether this is one tenth or quarter scale. The one where he's got a sword. Yeah, he's got to see it just in the back. I think he's got a tenth. It's one tenth. Uh, this then is a custom venom sculpted by Franco Carlissimo. Yeah, this is fun. Oh, yeah. this is a this is quite a like this is quite a conflicting <laughs> one for us because this is actually a, a stunning piece, but the fucking guy behind this is is just. Yeah, he used to well, he used to be like, was, he, you know, he was one of one of the first people that like fucking praised me and insulted me in the same sentence. It was just like <laughs> funny. Do you know one of them? The one one was like, well, uh, every, like John Cena, every everything before butt is is bullshit. Yeah. Like you're a legend, but you're a dirty stinking cunt. It was a bit like, wanna, and it was. Well, I don't want to offend you. But I don't want to offend you, but yeah, you're yeah. this, that, and the other. It was a bit like right, okay. Oh, yeah, but, but I mean, this this actually, uh, you know, regardless of that, it, this looks amazing. And there's also a green goblin. But I haven't got the pictures for that, but the green goblin. This, this looks amazing it's really nice and the way I, lo I, I love, love the this. thing I love about this is it's so uh, kind of classic and it's so like um, it's museum and it's so easy to display also this is going to uh, potentially be one piece with no switch outs I don't think you need switch outs it doesn't need it when and, it's done well, uh, as well as this is it doesn't I mean look at that I yeah. mean the, the proportions on that are perfect Stunning. this is proper classic McFarlane the body uh, proportions are amazing really good. Yeah. absolutely perfect they've managed to capture the athleticism but yeah. power of you've got to take it this out, character, you which take it isn't, I don't think it's very, it's very difficult to do. Not many people have been able to do it. In fact, probably nobody has done it as well as this has been done. I think this is, to me, this is probably the best way of. I would agree. Um, I think, to, I think you know, some people get the power right, some people get the athleticism right, but they never get them both right. I mean, this is a really, really, really impressive piece. This is, this is a stunning bit of work. No yeah. doubt about it. Credit where credit is due. Totally. Uh, this is the funny thing, isn't it? People think that there's some sort of agenda. L uh, like or dislike anybody, mate. You know, we say if it's good, we we'll say if it's shit. We'll it's say actually it. very intelligent as well because the venom is going to be uh, potentially sculpted, uh, so cast in one piece. Yeah. And the head, you know, all those teeth are not going to break. And they're all internal. Uh, they're all internal. Yeah. Uh, the head doesn't remove, so there's no seams. The arms don't remove those seams. It's genius, really. Uh, it's very clever. And but it's, it's done well. You know, you could do, you could, so, you could try to mimic that job. But you have to get it right. Yeah. I mean, you Frank, have to get that body right, and that body's right. Well, that Frank, is as good as it, that's as good as it gets. Franco sculpted and done an amazing job. I'm sure he had some direction, but yeah. Amazing. Uh, a really amazing. But also, piece. the price is uh, meant to be really high. Yeah. yeah, but there's only a few of them, right? If, as it's, far it's as I'm aware. Like, it's meant to be uh, one of those pieces which is like a true, meant to be a true collectible. So it's meant to be a very low edition size. I think it's still put up down to about 25. 2025. Oh, I heard it was 10. Uh, I think it's gone up a bit. But then the price has dropped to like 1500. Okay, I heard it was two and a half G's and it was 10. I heard it's not painted. No, no, it's different. It's, it was okay. originally meant to be. Okay. But apparently now it's like more and then less. But okay, well, that, as long as that's the number that goes up. See, that's the funny thing. That makes sense to me. Yeah, if yeah. it's two and a half and there's only 10, that makes sense. Yeah, when yeah. you do 145 and you want two grand, then you've got some explaining to fucking do. Omega, red, I mean, bullshit. Yeah. But yeah, you know, I mean, again, this is yeah, nice piece. Really stunning really piece. Stunning, stunning, uh, stunning work. <laughs> I bought this. <laughs> um, you do love, was, you do love Conan, man. Yeah, I've, I've always wanted a Conan. I've always wanted the original kind of sideshow one. Um, was, I was got let down on the one third yeah, as well, didn't I you? I got let down on the one third one that fell through, and uh, I've been speaking to. Uh, uh, to Bushy about a couple of other things and uh, Conan came up in conversation yeah. and uh, I basically told him that you know I'll give him a, uh, a Brazilian Jiu Jitsu fight 
uh, we had a one-on-one -on -one battle and, uh, and I won so he was going to send me a Conan <laughs> so you know he had a really you, I mean, you he had dream. a really bad back at you the time you can dream and um, you know Bushy would beat you with <laughs> fucking no back he's a black he'd, belt fucking teacher he'd beat you yeah. he'd beat you with just his legs turned up he'd beat you <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he just got an old statue and he fucking drops every statue that he's seen it. Well, let's hope, he, let's hope he doesn't QC yeah, yours. Well, let's hope he don't touch it. It's stays with it. Yeah, but I've got this coming soon. Very yeah. interested to see this because I think this is one of them, one of these statues that doesn't photograph as well as it may it look. It does. I mean, it makes him look a bit like a Native American. Yeah, he definitely looks like he's uh, he's the Milwaukee tribe. But I, I'm really excited to get this in. Do you know what Milwaukee stands for? Yeah. The good land. What, the, like Keanu, the breeze over the water or something, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> but I'm really, really excited about getting this one in and uh, can't wait. Can't yeah, wait. Looks, I'm very interested to see also, this. Also, next time I go to Israel or France or somewhere, I'm going to get choked out by Bushy. Yep, <laughs> oh, that's always nice. <laughs> worth it. <laughs> totally worth it. Well, if the statue's nice, it's worth it. If it's not, then it ain't worth nothing. Awesome. Um, what a pile of steaming shit that is. from uh, this to this. Um, I really don't like them flames all over it. I think that's uh, awful, that is. I don't know what side you're thinking. I really do this not. This is I shite, don't, that. I don't think... It's horrible. You know, if you're going to... The face really, looks great. The rest of it's if shit. If you're going to remake a character, you need to go forward. And yeah, this definitely isn't this, forward, this is it? This isn't forward. No, it isn't forward. These, these flame parts are ridiculously shit. And uh, if they're doing them, they need to match the base. They need to be like pinky shit. Yeah. I know what they're trying to do. They're trying to do like she's uh, kind of about to turn into the Dark Phoenix. Doesn't look like that. It looks no, like it she's on fire like and she's gonna yeah. she's gonna drop roll and what do you call it? Drop? Was <laughs> it stop? Drop and roll or whatever yeah, it's so, called? Yeah, someone just said, "Fuck that's too much hairspray." Right here. <laughs> <laughs> stop, drop and roll. <laughs> stop, drop. <laughs> but basically, like if you look at the base there, it looks like an afterthought. Like, it looks like fucking Cyclops sneezed at her feet. And then, you know, <laughs> if it, it should be that the... Uh, this is junk, this. It's the awful. exclusive should either be the uh, same colour as the base, or the base should be the colours of this, where it's kind of the, the phoenix is coming up and that's the approach they're going for. It's a bit of a mishmash. Really. I just, think it's, I just think it's garbage. I, I, really like the, I really like the portrait, but I, I dislike every single other thing about it. Yeah. I don't like the colours, I don't like the pose, I don't like anything about it, I don't like the X, I don't like the base. I don't like the arse. No, I don't like these panels that are down, I think they just look like they're added on and not even sort of like highlighted in any way. That's not bad. No, I don't like any of that. Well, I wouldn't say no to that or that. No, I don't like it. I don't like the pixel. Please give a very short of you arriving into Milton Keynes. Milton Keynes Central, our next stop. Ooh, hello. Hello, hello, hello. hello. No. <laughs> Alright, so we go through that one, we didn't get very much uh, love. Sideshow there, so Prime Warner then teasing on their Instagram about the uh, uh, Lord of the Rings pieces. So this looks like an Orakai that they are going to do. Oh yeah, maybe yeah, with the el with the um, elven sort of armor. That looks cool. Yeah. So Lord of the Rings. I really, and apparently they're doing a quarter scale Lord of the Rings. Oh, so that is going to be very impressive. Yeah, yeah. Really cool. Really cool. Then this is coming in. So. Yeah, Do you want to take this. over from here? Well, yeah, I've got this coming in. I'm, I'm excited to see this will be arriving. I don't like the He-Man here. I actually really do. What I like as well is uh, our, good f our boy in Red Titan. This isn't his pictures. You should have had his pictures oh, up, actually. Uh, would you? Yeah, he, we just did his room tour. Well, yeah, been up it's, going up. it's going up soon. It's a really nice room tour. He just took some fantastic photos of this. He's quite, he's quite he's, funny. Yeah, he's, he's well right funny. He is, I don't know if he's intentionally trying to be funny. I hope he is because he's really he is, funny. Because I was laughing. Because I was laughing too. I thought he was hilarious. So I'm, I'm, I'm hopeful that he's trying to be funny, um, and he's just really humorous. Um, this, yeah, it, the, the pictures in hand of this are absolutely amazing, and the the base is painted My fantastically. My favorite thing well. is actually the cape. Like the cosmic on the cape. The I really like the I really like the, the, the physique on it. I really love his pose and physique. And the eyes have got like a gold sort of sheen, sort of metallic look through the eyes, which uh, Matey Boy took some really good pictures of. Yeah, his pictures were better. Yeah, this is nice, but we'll get it. You know, get it in hand soon, so you'll be able to see this. But yeah, I've got shipping notice on it, paid shipping, so it's on its way. Yeah, it comes from my house on Tuesday. Yes. Which yeah, don't know why. Maybe it's redirected to your fucking house. Get redirected if you want to. All right, we'll go. Talk about that later. Not really time, is it? No, not now. <laughs> and then you got the uh, yeah space space squid. Yeah, it's almost like out of Guardians of the Galaxy, isn't it? That's why I sort of liked it. Yeah. So and then these are uh, 
April Fool's. Uh, some it? April Fool's stuff that uh, Pro Bob was saying, which is quite funny, where they were going to do the uh, the Superbird with his moustache and his smiling. That was done on Face Up, I can tell. Yeah, that's really cool. Yeah, yeah. so you got that. Uh, then, okay, here we go. Then we've got Ash, who doesn't uh, even look like Ash. Right, then you've got the Evil Dead Ash, which I have seen in person, and I do <coughs> like it in person. I do think it's a really I don't cool know piece. what you're talking about. Um, I don't think the likeness is as bad in person, but my problem is actually... In Venice, no likeness the, is as bad as in, in, in... No likeness is as bad in person as it is in photos. None. Okay. Photos of so like... Agree? Yeah, okay. because like, likenesses in photos are taken from, from a 2D perspective. And yeah, yeah. I don't think any portrait of any picture, uh, it doesn't work for me. It, yeah. No, there's no photo. I've had loads of statues in my, front of me I've tried to capture the, and I can't. Uh, the middle head and the exclusive are just two similar. Yeah, they're really, they're really like, close, aren't they? What the fuck? Did yeah. yeah. And they should have like, used one of them zombie heads in it. They need the possessed heads. They really need the yeah. possessed head. That's what they need to do. Hair all looks a bit too close as well, doesn't it? It all looks a little too yeah. similar to me now. It's just like, why would you pay fifty dollars extra when you know, they're just? I think that it should be the exclusive. Yeah. You should get them two as the the, the right and the middle. Yeah, the one <laughs> That's the closest. The one on the well, left hand the side. One on the left almost looks like um, Evil Dead One because he looks like younger. Yeah, I, I can see that. Sorry. One on the left hand side is the closest. To him, yeah. none of them are close enough in these pictures, but that is the closest. Yeah. I was so disappointed there was no possessed head. Yeah. The, uh, the laughing. I also don't like all of this nonsense. I don't like all of this. Uh, like, in the base. I like the base parts and things like that, but I really don't like Kardashian, the wall the and Kardashian, the uh, Kardashian dagger. Or, okay. Uh, the hand, the possessed hand. Like this, all of this under the thing. But it's that part I really don't like. The sort of stag head, and I mean, this is like for me, this is like a big fucking Wendy house. So it's like a big doll house where you basically have you have wallpaper on it and a chandelier hanging from it, and all that bollocks, and you put all you know furniture in it. Would you look at the price? Fifteen hundred dollars. Nah, it's a great price for this. It's a great price. This this is massive. It's a great price. It's a great price. A great price. Fifteen hundred dollars. You're not paying any more for all of that extra. That's and then true. Fifteen hundred dollars for the. Uh, my problem. My problem is this, right? You look at the piece as a whole, yeah? You put that like that, leave that there. You put that with your other statues and it all of a sudden looks like other statues should have more to them. I guess. It's like, where the fuck's the, where's the wall? Yeah. Where's, the, where's, the, where's the backdrop? All the others just have a base, what happened? Yeah, I guess. Right, so that's Ash Williams. Hopefully- uh, Is that his name? Ash Williams, I didn't know that. Ash <laughs> Jay Williams. No, I didn't know that. Yeah. I would never got that. If that was in a trivia question, I'd be fucked. <laughs> Oh, Ash what? I'd be like, Campbell? Ash? I don't know, it's a surname. This is uh, an artist who seems to have used the uh, sanity for his comic cover. Oh yeah. <laughs> oh wow. Well they say that, uh, what's it? Um, Copying is the best form of flattery or some yeah. shit. These are um, some teasers for Marcus Charles' cable. Yeah, this is uh, so, Gravin Labs cable, isn't it? Yeah, this is basically based off of this artwork. Really like the cable, really wish it didn't have the Deadpool. I did say to him I would take the Deadpool away. It's the same thing I, I no, said before. This is a little bit more modern of a cable, so it's not as bad. But I still think, you know, it doesn't need, it doesn't need it. Don't need that. Cable on his own is bad ass. Don't need the fucking Deadpool link all the time. Dust my head in. It's the bonus. I don't bonus. think so. I don't consider it a bonus. I, I consider it a distraction. Yeah, but he's going to be detachable, isn't he? I don't know how it's going to work. I, I really don't know the details, but I did say to him, man, I love that cable as it is. Please don't add them. Please take that Deadpool away. And he was just like, nah, sorry, dude. That's part of it. He's like, Shit. Well, it's part of the artwork. Yeah, that's what he said to me. So you can't do that. Uh, then you've got some Psylocke action. Yeah, so some Psylocke action. Sexy yeah. woman. American woman. She's not American. Stay away from me. Yeah, there you go. Really yeah. looking forward to seeing how that comes through. That's very early. Uh, just wanted to show Just that. really sort of a different kind of pose on that and all, you know. It's yeah. going to be interesting, that. Uh, but then you've got the PCS Soundwave, which was... Uh, this went out for pre-order, and it was like $220. Wow. Quarter scale. It's just like, no, no. It's no, not, is it 1.6, isn't it? It's or like, you can't do well, this. Yeah, what you can't do it. It's Transformers, isn't it? And it comes with uh, Rumble. <laughs> I would wish it come with Ravage, but Ravage is my favourite. Ravage the dog. Uh, the cat. Part. The bamf. Yeah. Yeah. We really, like, demasculated it, didn't we? Yeah. The dog, the, the parrot. <laughs> <laughs> the dog, the parrot, the, the tape. Dog, the parrot, the <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, Soundwave is my favourite, and I, love, I just love Soundwave. 
Mm. I remember he's the one I remember more the most. The yeah. guy that does the thing on the ground and it all sort of like shakes. Yeah, That's what, yeah. There's two of them. There's two men. Oh, right. I just remember there's that Rumble one. And there's another one, but I can't remember the other man's name. Yeah. And then there's Radar, who's the bat. Yeah. Uh, and then there's Laser Beak. Yeah. Oh, there you go. And then I don't know why this is an exclusive because I don't shit. Has he got a cotton bud in his hand? What's that? I don't know. It looks like fucking Mega Man. It does really, like an unpainted one. Yeah. Um, this is a tease then for. Oh fuck, I forgot her name. This is a Street Fighter character. I think it's Laura. Oh, Laura, yeah, the yeah. Brazilian fighter. Yeah, 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 it's yeah, Laura. So this is a tease for Laura. Yeah, yeah. So they're going to be working on that. That's cool. This is the update for uh, Shakura. Is that Shakura? Shakura? S- yeah, something like Sakurai. This is the update. Sakurai. This is the, um, the exclusive version. Looks much uh, better. This is 100 million times better than Yeah, much one. better. The one they showed in New should York have never Comic shown Con should that. never have been shown. It was a pile of shit. And this looks good. So fix much though, looks much better. Awesome fix, there you go. Yeah, Sakura. much better, much, much better. Sakura. And this is like, yeah, infinitely better. So I'm really glad they sorted that out. Uh, Shazam! So this is for Hot Toys. I don't know why this is here. Hot Toys. Damn are doing, you, Chad. Hot Toys do the Shazam. Got that, that stuck in there, didn't it? Yeah, that get in there. Uh, Comic Con Singapore. Toy game, sorry, Singapore Toy Game Comic Con. It's December this year. Moved and changed the name. So uh, it's moved to December. So it used to be. September. Um, quite disappointed because this is now Colson's birthday. Yeah, same. And, yeah, uh, it's really close days to mine. Yeah, it's four days about my birthday. So. I'm not sure what I can do about that one. If you go, we're not friends anymore. Fuck off. <laughs> if I go, you're probably going to give me a fucking shopping list of shit to bring back. This is true. Well then. Wait, it's my birthday. <laughs> and Christmas. And Christmas. Christmas, yeah. Christmas, and Christmas, Christmas. Yeah. <laughs> that's what they do with Christmas. Like, yeah. yeah. Um, this is it's a, like me, that's yeah. nice. Well, of course it's one as well. So. Yeah. Um, this is a custom spider man. I can't remember who does this one. But this one is, there's quite a lot of these at the moment. Hmm. Uh, quite like this one. Not too bad. Very dull, isn't it? Yeah, it's quite early though. Looks cool though. Uh, yeah. Quite, quite like cool. the person. You know what it reminds me of? You remember that one that came out that was brass? Bronze. Yeah, bronze. You know bronze. what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. It looks for the pose very similar to that stuff. Does actually? It does it really does? Uh, these are the, the Queen Studios ones, which amazing. My Crazy. Girlfriend actually Crazy. was um, really uh, in Photoshop with him. Yeah. So that's uh, Tom Huddleston. That looks. Ridiculous. Nuts, Absolutely mate. Nuts. Ridiculous. Looks crazy. And uh, then you got the T1000 again. Looks like an angry teacher. <laughs> you will not interrupt my lesson. And then you got the uh, Spider-Man. So yeah, that's Spider-Man. cool as well. Uh, uh, Terminator. 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 Yeah, got loads, loads of cool pieces here. Apparently, there's an error on the jaw. A few people have mentioned they're trying to correct a few pistons. Cool. Uh, Mark, Mark Hamill doing yeah. the voice for Chucky that's amazing isn't it that'd be quite cool because he does Joker he's a great he's great he's at great it. yeah Joker. he's really good he'd be really good at Chucky in all actually uh, uh, yeah we need one, it. Yeah. we need another Red Sonja don't we taking over Red Sonja that's another just thing. giving that license to anybody who will even attempt it uh, I don't know what this is oh Berserker Armour loads, loads of issues with the Berserker Armour uh, Promo Studios that's a uh, recall shipment of the Berserker Armour so uh, yeah Berserker Armour Guts has been recalled apparently. Is that one that Chad's got? Too many breakages. Uh, no, he wants the one third. Ah. Uh, I think we showed that last time. Yeah, with the, all the Spider Mans. All of them look crap. All legendary scale, yeah. This then is a custom Canada on his bike from Kira. <laughs> so his face looks fucked. It, look, it does, doesn't it? <laughs> his face is horrible, but the actual. Looks yeah, it looks but better, yeah. That I love bike that bike, mate. Yeah, it's just like, you don't, who gives a shit? You can have no head. Well, it's, it's the coolest uh, bike ever. And you've got to remember, like, uh, Kira, Old. I'm pretty sure it's like 83. Yeah, I thought it was late 70s. It might be, it might be 82, 83. Yeah, this little star's 84. Wow, yeah. man. Dude, we were like three years old. Yeah. Me you. I mean, th- this just had its 35th anniversary. Wow. Yeah, so, so there you are. Same. Yeah, yeah. But it's about 82 and 83, isn't it? So that is very nice. Beautiful, yeah. Uh, what's this one? We've got this coming in April. This is shipping out soon. I'm still waiting for Marcus Chow to give me my fucking shipping notice so I can pay him. If you're watching, fucking send out the shipping. Yeah, get your rack together, Chow. But this is the gravel. It's probably his bin. Oh, I don't know. Like the clay. Oh, no, yeah. That's all it is. That is bears. Oh, that's his fucking Kubrick bear things. Oh, God damn it. Marcus. Yeah. The cloud. So this is the Graven Labs, and obviously this in hand with the beast. Look at that scaling, perfect, isn't it? Perfect. 
So then, Perfect. Uh, 15 minutes, I think. Yeah, and then also, uh, Connecticut's released their Geo's guns. Did you see that? No. Yeah, it's a discount code. That's awesome. <laughs> it's, it's, it's expired now, I think. But oh. Uh, I do. No one tells me the good shit, dude. Good. Nobody tells me the good oh, stuff. That's awesome. Things. She's hot as well. Yeah, she's she's done really well. She's amazing. It's an amazing looking beast. So, cool. More of these. It's coming up. <laughs> dude, you really did go. You really got a lot of them in there. I told you they're all over the place because yeah. always on my Oh, but you really got like a lot of them ones, innit? Yeah. Um, Who's that? Then this is from uh, Devil May Cry. Devil so this is the origin Devil May Cry yeah. coming soon from. Prime one, and then what we do is I'll load up the videos and uh, we'll go on to the old XM pieces. Perfect, that's all we want. Right, yo, 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 everybody. So it's well vibrating, you know, well, well, well. <laughs> right? So it's uh, Alex and Geo from Red Time, and we are on our way home from Birmingham with the magic of editing. You're going to see this before the videos. And then we're going to probably talk again after the videos, which is going to be cut together in a seamless uh, video, which looks like a chat. Magic. Hopefully. With the magic of editing. <laughs> magic. Hopefully. But now we've just spoiled the magic that you've seen behind the wizard's curtain. So <laughs> Ignore what's up the wizard's yeah, sleeve. Yeah, well, you know, the wizard's sleeve is uh, sometimes... Is that good. all right? Yeah. So um, what we're doing is um, we're just going to go through the, uh, the new XM Studio pieces. So we're going to go through the, um, the Sabretooth... Uh, Ultron, Ultron, Colossus, Lobo, uh, Magic, um, <laughs> Lobo, Cyborg, Lobo and Cyborg, yeah, one six stuff. Is that six? <laughs> that is six. Cyborg, Magic, Lobo, Colossus, Ultron, we didn't say. Colossus, Saber Two. Yeah, so I think six. I said Saber yeah, Two four yeah. times. Right. Right. Saber right. Two. <laughs> so what we're gonna do is, yeah, we're gonna go through those pieces. So, all right, let's go on to that, and you're gonna cut now to the Magic, you know, of uh, enjoy. Yeah, you enjoy this. Yo, yo, yo. All right, so this is Alex and Gio. We're in, um, we're actually not there, but uh, <laughs> <laughs> I wish we were in we wish we were there. We're on a, tra uh, we're on a train traveling to Birmingham on our way to John Jonathan Meddens' yeah. birthday. So we thought we'd do a bit of work. So we're working on the road. This is, we're gonna be going over the Colossus from XM Studios that was recently shown in um, Toy, Ki it's Toy Kings Toy in Kings. Thailand. Um, for me, I think uh, I'm just gonna go off and do a spoiler and say this is, for me is probably the highlight piece of the uh, of the reveals. So let's get into it. All right, let's go in. So um, yeah, Colossus has done really, really well. They've made a uh, fantastic job of the sort of texturing of the body, uh, the leather on the uh, the red on the suit, and then the texturing again on the yellow. Um, again, going down to the boots, the um, sort of metallic colour of the boots, phenomenal. Really, really, really nice. And then the base as well is just not another. It's got the central base, but it's kind of like. Um, out there she's yeah. quick in it yeah we want to also go over that base as well yeah that's perfect yeah. around there i mean you can see that there's all these sentinel elements but what's great about it is it's uh they didn't go full retard on this and they basically got some environmental factors too so they got yeah. like a brick wall built built around the back and they have this like rock girder yeah well. they've got girders and some metallic parts and some sort of sentinel butt plug thing going on in the middle yeah, which is sure that is yeah it looks so. great though yeah. I, I think the contrast in colors and textures is fantastic on this piece really well done I mean, look yeah, at that, and then with him holding the eye like he's going to swing the eye at and hit and smash someone with it. Well, with the eye, I mean, let's just get another frame on. With the eye there, there's cause there's a lot of detail going on in there, but they are looking into doing a flickering uh, effect on the light. Not really needed, but it's a nice option. Great to add, have. yeah, and you can I see mean, that brick wall there in the back as well. That's yeah, like half built, yeah. half knocked down. It's great. Really clear video, actually. Brian's done a good job. Yeah, there. well done, Brian, mate. Sexy Brian. Need to send you a nice T-shirt as well because that RT logo that you have <laughs> needs a bit of work. <laughs> yeah, oh, it's pretty bad on design still. Yeah. Um, so then we can move on a little bit. Love the way this looks like the cables coming around. I'd love to know what they're kind of made from. Look at the look at the muscularity though. How they've managed to capture that. I mean, yeah. you can see there sort of underneath his arm. You can see he's like lats and serratus mm. obliques. You know, and he's they're really thick, so they've really captured the build on this Colossus perfectly because it's quite a complicated um, bit body, really, because he's tall as well as really thick, and that's quite hard to sort of like that's hard to get. Yeah, you know, I, I thought that the, the uh, Saito Premium Format one was actually pretty decent, but obviously the base is a bit weak, and the, the, the pose is obviously very static for the time. Well, you got to remember again, it's good, yeah, for the time because I mean, that was a good that was made a good few years ago, yeah. so things evolve. Um, as you see, you got the lever on the red there. I love that kind of texturing there. And then you got the um, it breaks up, doesn't it? Like uh, 
they're not porous kind of like when yeah. it's like a sweat sweat material. Yeah, it's almost like a it's not almost like rubber, but, you know. yeah, it's sort of like it's almost like a like an armored plated like Kevlar almost sort of material going through there, like stab proof or whatever it is. You can tell we're in London. Yeah, I don't know. Well, we're going to Birmingham. We probably need more there, but yeah, that's um, a good point. But no, I, I love that. Then also this, I think that that head comes off there. At where the, yeah, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. The, the seam, comes, yeah, it's a great seam. There is another head. I really, I really like the way they've got the wrinkles on that seam as well, though, and the way they've done the armor plated up the neck. I think moving on to this, you can see like we start getting up into the head and the portrait, that flat top, iconic flat top. I mean, yeah. that's amazing. That this yeah. is by far the best Colossus I think I've ever seen, and really an exceptional was, job from it. Right to I, I have here. to, I have to buy this. Oh, yeah. I definitely have to buy this. Look at that expression. What, what's the and other the head? Is it got like a? I think it's a more calm head, isn't it? Yeah, probably. That would because he's sense. a very calm character, isn't he? So yeah, but this one, I mean, this this portrays what he's doing uh, much better. Yeah, it definitely so, looks uh, like teeth. Yeah. I love the way they've done the teeth as well. Because he does have like humany like teeth. They're not metal, they are always they? Do. Yeah, I mean Wolverine as well. Wolverine's got metal bones, and he's yeah. got teeth. Yeah, but technically speaking, teeth are well, like that one. yeah. So, yeah, but social team still look out across as a thief. Yeah, he'd have both. I mean, look at the plating yeah, up the yeah. side there. I really think that that breakup of contrast on yeah. their materials are fantastic. It's a little bit of a metal, like, spike thing. For, you can see where, as it goes up, it sort of cuts in there into the right. corner. No, nah, that body there looks fantastic. Really, really nice. Love really that gold, gold belt as well. More modern sort of yeah. style belt. It looks fantastic. It looks like it's real gold and all. Fantastic. Not much of a bulge going on, is he? Uh, it's, not, uh, it's, uh, it's, uh, it's not packing, that's for sure. Packing. It's not the size of the now, it's the size of the hammer. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, let's finish on that one. Yeah. Alright, let's just continue. Alright, so now we've got the cyborg. This is the one six scale. Um, this I've been told the face on this isn't finished. This was just done to get it done in time uh, for this tour. Yeah. Uh, sorry for this um, yeah, exhibition. Yeah. The um, the material is a different type of material than the black panther. So um, they, they used like a translucent uh, resin for the Black Panther. Yeah. So on this, they had to use different paint techniques and it took a little bit more time. Yeah. So this is not complete before anyone complains about how no company gets all, um, the side, kind of yeah, the face black right. skin right. Uh, but going on, I mean, this is a 1-6 scale. These one I'm six really excited about this, yeah. Oh, are so detailed. I mean, like, uh, saying done a fantastic job painting this up there. It doesn't look bad considering that face is not done. They, yeah. I mean, they're not happy with it, but yeah. I mean, I don't think it's bad at all. Well, Sang's an exceptional painter, to be honest. It almost he? looks like uh, a little bit red. Uh, Samuel Jackson's character in um, um, Shaft. No, 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 that cartoon. Cartoon? Uh, Where's the freeze guy? Oh yeah, Fro uh, Frozone. Yeah, Frozone. Yeah, Frozone. Frozone. Yeah, it, what's that? Incredibles. Uh, Incredibles. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nice. It does look a little bit like that, but it doesn't look like that. <laughs> but I mean, they're, they're working on that. I mean, there is so much detail in these one six scales. I mean, we're going to, I don't know, with the magic of uh, editing and whatever else, I don't know whether the Lobo is first or second, but with, in the Lobo, you see how much detail they can put in. I think Lobo scales. may be the best one six I've ever seen. I uh, think there's been made, to be honest. Right. I think it'll be a hard well, challenge. We're on this one. So so I don't know. For me, like, I'm not a big, I'm not a big cyborg fan. I but don't I've, really know anything about cyborg. I'm not going to lie to you. Um, I mean, I know that he can uh, evolve. He's a bit like an Ultron character. Isn't it's he? like I mean, a, obviously it's Ultron kind of. It's like a, it is like artificial intelligence. Though. It's yeah, just yeah. like self learning, isn't it? He just like sort of evolves. evolves as time goes. He can make pretty much any weapons out of himself, and yeah, he can yeah. turn himself into a fucking bomb if he wants to. Yeah. I really like it. I've, I mean, I've the been, done a fantastic and job. There's going to be loads and loads of switch outs for this with this one six line. Yeah. Uh, paint job is fantastic. Again, Sing does a great job on that. Uh, the base. Again, oh, that's that. cool. What's he like? like a, he's killed one of the fucking Dino Transformers. Dino bots. Yeah, one of the Dino bots. Yeah. <laughs> but no, it's like again all the rust on the on the base done fantastically, um, and also this one is a lot more displayable. Like it? the cable, the busted cable. I think that's really good. Is that a tongue? Yeah. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, yeah. That's yeah, yeah, really, yeah. really cool. Really nice. There's a lot of hidden details in this one. A lot. I mean, I'd like to see this one in person. I mean, the one six scale stuff I saw. I saw the uh, the Superman, the Joker, uh, the Wonder Woman. Yeah. Joke about Aquaman, and yeah. uh, they all look fantastic. Yeah, it's a strong line. So uh, yeah, they're really. I saw back. them as well in London. He did. Yeah, he did, really he nice. Did. 
nice of you to try and make out that you'd seen them and I had not. Well, I saw them before you. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> but I mean, yeah, it's a really, really nice piece. And, uh, yeah, good then, job on that. I'm looking to see how they evolve. The only the only critique I could say at the minute is the, the, the narrowness of the legs. Yeah. Um, they sort of, the pins look like they're in the same place. So it will need, to, you understand what I mean? One well, leg's slightly weight, out to the, the yeah, the weight, right exactly. Right yeah, exactly uh, my point. So yeah. let's hope that uh, that's well engineered because it's these sort of walking, almost walking like poses on statues that make me nervous. Yeah. As we saw with Sideshow's Mystique, the fucking thing wobbles all over the damn place. Yeah. And that's not a heavy piece. So oh. if you have like a big, if you had a big cannon on our arm, yeah, we'd have a, even more yeah, of a problem. Probably remember this isn't Sideshow. Yeah, well, that's a good point to make. <laughs> all right, let's, let's move on to the uh, to the next one. Was there any more of that? No. So one, two, three, and uh, tap all the so uh, um, this is the highlight this one so this right. is the 1.6 Lobo from XM and uh, wow as you can see on the right hand side of the screen is uh, that's a quarter scale Star Lord and he is actually quite a big piece massive so piece so if you look actually. at that quarter scale Star Lord compared to the 1.6 Lobo yeah, Lobo is massive. The difference is, though, is that what we're talking about is uh, I think Peter Quill is around about six foot, and I think Lobo is coming up close to seven. No, he's not. I six think, nine no, is. No, he's not. He's not. No, no, no. How I, big is I he? looked up recently because I saw the um, uh, Batman next to Lobo, and they were like the same size. So six four then. And he's like yeah, six three, six four. Yeah, oh wow, yeah. okay. I thought Lobo yeah. was bigger than that. So did I. I always thought he was like massive, massive. It's all about being different eyes for in different ways, but anywho, we, 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 we I mean, look at, the look at the fucking paint on that. Have you ever seen? I mean, that this for a, oh, yeah, for I don't a think I've seen a better one six piece than this. I mean, they obviously the studios have uh one six scale Lobo color, it's nothing near this. Uh, no, it's not even close to this. As a one six, that is a thousand dollars. This isn't going to be a thousand dollars, it's going to be cheaper, and this looks phenomenal to me. Lo looks, I love that. It's like my, my favorite of. All of the uh, recent Lobos, XM, all the all the XM um, uh, one six pieces. Oh yeah, piece definitely, easily. Ridiculous. I mean, look um, at that paint. Shit, look. We, at they've that. got it all out with the paint. You've got skeleton so hands, we, skeleton yeah. bones under there. They've also gone with the uh, the classic look with the uh, uh, the toxic blood. Because oh, it's on the original stuff is all is all like uh, green blood. Yeah, I've so got they went covers with that. I think Stank said he tried to use uh, red blood, but. It looked better as green because it's more like popping. Yeah, definitely. He's so, done a cracking job painting this, oh, son. He's done details, an amazing like job the, painting. Uh, this. It's like NOS on top of there. Yeah, yeah. Um, you got like all the, all the colours. You got kind of hair on the arms yeah, there, the yeah. veinage up his forearms, the, 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 the textured in hair. Amazing. As a, as a one six piece again. I mean, have you seen a better one? Not with this much detail. No, really, I agree. This, this is insane work. This is insane. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I, I was, yeah. Just insane three, three, three heads, right? And two switch out dogs and a yeah. gun and a hook. I, I mean, just, this I, is serious well, business. I'll, I'll be happy just with the dog. <laughs> yeah. <but laughs> I love the other dog. Though. This dog yeah, here it, is really cool. That's like one that really uh, you can put, because you can move the dog, can't you, to the side of yeah, the... Yeah, you can put it to the side of the bike. And he's yeah. got three switch. He's got other two arms. Yeah, he's got so one with got a gun, hook, one with a hook, yeah. And then he's got the dog will go on the side of the bike. Like this, and, pose. Uh, yeah, this one is the side I of the bike one. one. Yeah, and I think the other one is where he's got his mouth like, like yeah. flapping in the wind. Almost like uh, the X-Men scene, isn't it? With a French bulldog and yeah, pizza. Yeah, exactly. With Quicksilver. Um, yeah. That could have, that could have the, the braids in his hair really good, that. So, so much detail. I mean, really, that's really mental cool. going through there. If I go to the XM office, I'm going to nick those dogs. Yeah, def get me one. Get me one of the slobbery <laughs> faced one. I want the slobbery faced one. Look at that triceps. Yeah. And then you've got like all the details. There's so many textures. But there's on. a space dolphin uh, on his leglet. The, the jacket, you've got the jeans, you've got the belt, you've got the arm, you've got the hair of the arm. Uh, they also decided as well. Actually, it's not going around there yet. Yeah, there you go. So the textures on the jeans just popped. Actually, every time I pause it, goes smooth. But you can see it was moving. So there's the... Oh, look the at the, the, the thing coming out of the back. Uh, the, I love the fact they've gone with blue uh, instead of red. Yeah, they, 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 they tried again. They've got the jacket there. That's oh, amazing. The fat boy. Really, that really is cool. fucking amazing. Again, I mean... Uh, that I is the best 1-6 like scale piece oh, I've ever go, seen. Here you go. Oh, man, Brian's on four. Brian, look at you flying. Why have you got a dog's face in there, Brian, you yeah, fuckhead? That's all <laughs> There's all the switch out, so you've got the arms. So if you want to put the dog on the side, oh, and you've got the other head. I love there. it with the glasses as well yeah. for the bike. That's perfect. The glasses one, the, like, the, the goggles. Let's hope he picks up the dog. I haven't seen this video yet, so. Ah, there. great job, Brian. Boom. Great job. Look at the rust Boom. on the gun. Boom. There you go. Yeah, that's amazing. That one. Get down, Joe. Get, get down. Get down, Brian. Get down. Oh, you oh, fucking you. Beauty. That's the one time Brian doesn't go down. <laughs> Yeah, Amazing. Little fanny pack at the back. Amazing. <laughs> and there you go. He's getting his money out and riding his stomach. Uh, awesome. 
and then like the red on the knee pops. I mean, yeah. uh, what they did then, Crazy. I'm hoping this comes Crazy. around all the way. So they decided with the blue flames again. This is to um, because they tried it with the uh, kind like of oranges, oranges yeah. and yellows, and it just popped so much more with the with the blues. Ah, it's lovely with so, the blue. Really glad yeah, they chose them really colour. Really, it's amazing. Absolutely outstanding. Breathtaking this piece. Yeah, totally. Really breathtaking. I've, I've, I've got, I would love to see how much that costs as uh, you know, one Four. six piece. Uh, there you go. All right. So next one is Ultron. Um, You're loving this, aren't you? You are really loving this. Look, that's a great clarity. That. It's yeah, great clarity. Uh, no, I thought it was a little skinny. I just thought it looked a little skinny, and I'm not sure about the, I'm not sure about the add-on <laughs> arms. I mean, it looks like there's a little bit of a gappage kind of underneath his sort of midsection where the arm goes. It just well, looks a bit gappy there. I, I mean, mean, maybe, you, maybe uh, it's if maybe. You can see on his sides, you can see like the, uh, in the middle, like on his obliques, you can see that kind of thing sticking out. You he's got like, he's got two of them in his front and back. Yeah, yeah. They're like so uh, almost the, like power sources going into him. Uh, kind of or some kind of. Uh, hydraulic thing yeah but like um, basically they come out and you can put another arm so he has three arms on one side it's from um, a comic isn't it it's from a classic comic cover yeah yeah, yeah. and uh, I mean I like this one because it's paint looks it's mental really, the metal really yeah playable. it's growing on me actually it is growing on me you know, see if we get a face got like, all the kind of like this inside the mouth there like like it's uh, hot like it's flaming yeah, in it yeah. a little bit and uh, I mean I think this is there you go, it's better. yeah look at that there you go that's lovely so yeah, yeah. The face looks it's almost like great yeah. Ultron though with the multiple eyes going up the top. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And then you have also the texture on the inside of the panels. On it the looks bicep mental. Pack. It looks like a lot of work in this. A lot of work in this piece. Yeah, I actually out of all of them, I, th I really like this one, and I need to know the height. But this one looks so displayable. Yeah, well. really displayable. Detoff level displayable, doesn't it? This because it doesn't look yeah, very wide. Yeah. And then you've got all the texture. Yeah, it looks the fantastic. There's a lot of detail in here. It's, it's definitely one of these pieces I think you need to see more in person. Yeah. I think I, shots of it are not doing yeah, any yeah, justice. That's, that's yeah, that's mad. Right uh, just midsection. No, yeah, it's, 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 it's actually though. much more seamless. You're right. You are right. I, humble pie. I'll take it back. It does uh, look a lot more seamless up close. Also, those sort of pistol things on yeah, his legs. And then the, the, uh, the kind of rusty. Very detail. displayable, this. Very the rusty like, detail there on that drill bit. Like, yeah, crazy. The only thing is, it's a little. The, the colours are slightly similar to the rocks. The rocks on the bottom should probably be a, maybe a little bit more of a green. You know, like a, a like a. Well, because it's a bit close. Yeah, but I don't know. Sometimes in videos they, they don't the colours are blurred. Yeah, they're, they're, they're blurred colours, and they, they, they you know, merge into sort of one. And it's just whatever this piece is. That looks great at the back bag. as well. The high, that that sort of like en almost engine parts that are like. For fuck's sake! I'm not, I don't really want to buy anything at the moment. And you got the thrusters coming out the back. I think this is really good. I think this looks strong. I think I might have to order this. Look at that the spine. Back it's definitely the best Ultron that's out I there. I really like this. There's no I'm, doubt about it. Fuck's sake! I would order it. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna order this. I don't. I don't blame you. Well, I get Colossus. You get this. Well, and yeah. we're both. At least we're both. We, we go down that. We go down that sinking ship together. Yeah. Like it. Let's go together. Yeah, I'm definitely buy. I'm gonna buy that. I like it. I like it as well. I, I think really, uh, really it's, it's growing on me. And this is a fantastic video from Brian. He's done an exceptional job showing it all off here. Credit. He didn't fucking film the dog's face. Yeah. <laughs> it's really strong this is it looks great it really does actually and yeah. it doesn't look deep or oh, it looks, no, no, looks that, really on that is that is spot on um all right, what's next all right here you go saber tooth so saber this tooth. i think this is the one i think this is the one that probably gets the most critique from me because i really would like to have seen his hands opened they're like a little bit you know all them big bladed claws i mean it's just a little bit it's a little bit crunched up his hands i really would like to see them open slashing openly like really making the most out of them weapons um i really like the fact that they've like the contrast between his hair his beard and his mane because i really don't like it when they're all the same color yeah. and i think this is the texture in this looks crazy i think the colors are perfect yeah perfect all they, of the are, colors they are, are perfect, perfect. the orange is perfect the hair's perfect, the mane's perfect, the brown. The only thing is, the brown on the front, because it's so dark, you lose a lot of that sculpt. I mean, I I have one that had that brown's on the front, and you, you, you miss the chest and the abdomen, yeah. it's so dark. So you really want some highlights in there, like the shoulders are, oh. but maybe it's light, because there's not a lot of light here, and as you go round, keep going. And also, as you... I mean, his knee is going to block off a lot of it as well. Yeah. But the original pose, he had his head in front of his face, so, you know. Yeah, this is better. I mean, that head is insane okay, with okay, the teeth. That is mental, that head. Bob in focus. Look at that. That is crazy. That is that is an insane portrait, dude. That's an insane portrait. That. Uh, I'm sucking. Pause it. 
Yeah, but it's hard because this actually looks better. You know, yeah, I'm not sure about the beading that's going around that arm there. Yeah, I'm yeah, not sure it cuts that. across. I'm not sure if it's yeah, meant to. It cuts but... across the bicep like that. No, the around the middle of the arm. That bit there. Yeah, that yeah, bit. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, the bicep. Mm. Well, it goes across the tricep. Yeah, yeah, that's right. And then you got the um, nice, the a nice. This is where I have a little bit of a problem though, because the base is actually really conservative, but his leg fucking sticks out on its own. So well, why, why leave his leg hanging uh, out there? Apparently, it's seventy-two centimeters deep. That's really deep. Which is, if that's true, that is fucking ridiculous. That is crazy. Yeah, it's really, very deep. Really crazy. Base looks good. Like, like, Loads I of details. I saw. Yeah. Uh, it's almost like danger remiss. It's just that leg sticking out. I just can't get over that leg sticking out on its own like that. Yeah. That hand should be open, that left one. That right yeah, hand should be go, open. If I go back a little bit. Yeah, the leg. It just it's sticks kind of on its own. In the air and it's like, um, this looks weird. There's nothing underneath it, so it is a bit. I get what he's doing. He he's mid air, like, isn't he? He's like he's, jumping from uh, one to another or he's something. He's kind of jumping and then he's, he's going to push off with this one. Yeah, he's so, already landed on that right one and pushing he's off he's it from the other one. Go again. Yeah. Yeah, so it's like a double jump. So, well, yeah, like I mean, a ninja warrior. You know, the stop. It goes side to side. So, I mean, yeah, I mean... But the thickness of the body, the paint looks great. The, you know, I really... I just... I would love the nails to be open. And I'm not... I really don't like these spikes that are on his forearm because they're not part of the suit. Yeah. You know, they're not... You know, in the comics, it's like all part of the same suit. They look like they've been added to the blades. Yeah. So if you go to the forearm here, you'll see there, it looks like it's been added to the oh, suit right, as opposed yeah, to yeah. it being part of the glove. I like it when it's all just one. So for me, this this, this is probably the more disappointed because he's put one of my favourites and I, I won't... I, I can't order this based off what I'm seeing. Oops. Well, Okay, cool. So we're going on to Magic, which it, Magic is um, Colossus' sister, sister, right? Apparently. But what she, she, the head changes. She starts off as Magic, and then she can turn into Dark Child. Is that right? Dark Child. Yeah, yeah. 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 So, so um, this is this is quite impressive. This they're going to be installing some more uh, lights and things in this. They haven't actually got it yet. They're looking into the engineering of it, and uh, that's a possibility. I had someone funny uh, say to me say the other day. They copied the uh, Psylocke um, pose. This is so funny. Like, when they say really? shit like that. Oh. <laughs> Bearing in mind that this probably, this, you know, and Psylocke as well, both of them were probably done, I don't know, probably two years ago. They maybe. were working on this. Um, well, they, they had already shown this to me when I was in um, Singapore last time. So this was September. Yeah, but yeah, well I, I've already that. saw. No, no, I mean, seen. I, I, you've seen the seen retard, yeah. So I saw. No, I saw it. Sorry. No, it's not. Seen That's it. not English yet. Seen. Right. Well, I've okay. seen. I seen it. I not. I've. I saw it. It's not. English. Well, while I was in Singapore, I, I seen it. It was on the screen. Please make sure you volume between train and platform. Yeah. Commentary is the next stop. Oh, All right, let's start. Stop. No, no, we don't need to actually. Just carry on. Okay. I'll cut him out. All right, yeah. So the, as we said, this him. is uh, Corsa's sister, and uh, yeah, they're going to be working on putting more some more lights in here and things like that. They've got the um, is that a sentinel hand? Sentinel hand underneath. But the thing is, is with the sentinel hand on like Magneto and things like that, really? this is going to look like a little Jeremy Beadle hand. Oh yeah, it's a midget hand, yeah. So yeah, so I don't know whether that's going to work, but. Again, if they had the massive, massive hand, it may... It would be very silly. overpowering, wouldn't it? Uh, this is the switch out here. Dark with Child. The, the Dark Child horns. Yeah. Um, looks wicked as well. So the armour on her shoulder, Crazy, love that. Crazy, man. Body sculpt, fantastic. Uh, she's got some hips, man. Oh, she's got some. I'm on tonight, my hips <laughs> don't lie, I'm starting to see a boy. All right, then you got the, uh, yeah, working your way down. I mean, really, really cool. Nice the sword. The sword as well. Uh, and then this thing on the base is all like what is flame. it like a ram know, like, like ram a flame it's almost ram. like the devil yeah that is really fucking cool and then you've got the uh, the sentinel hand on the base and then you've got another head there as well like a demon head yeah man that's because I think she's the title dark dark magic yeah it must be so um, they're good they're good I mean is it, maybe she'll split like personality or something like that. But, so yeah and then you've got the uh, texture in there with the boots the straps all going round really nice really cool high heels oh the hands and fingers oh, are gone and then you got all the flames here as well I love the way them fingers are so, missing as well yeah yeah no that's really cool they've like been sliced completely and almost cauterized, cauterized like as they've sliced yeah, like no that's, that's nice that's almost a big like, sword uh, I didn't even see that sword it, behind it, it. it reminds me of like um, Cloud in Final Fantasy 7 the way the sword is that's just that's a big fucking sword she's right, playing the like Cloud that. Buster or whatever it's called 
but yeah, she's beautiful. Really, really. This gorgeous. is another exceptional but piece, yeah, really. Good pause there. Yeah. So yeah. Uh, For you, go uh, out for me. That's my sort of end. <laughs> she's lovely. Yeah, really nice. Love the no sort of uh, no pupils as well in the eyes. Mm. Well, the other one has pupils, so yeah. That's great. The sword yeah. running down there like that. All the flames the wrapping around flames it. That's wrapped. amazing. That stitching on her hips. Yeah, and there you go. Yeah, that's really. I love the burnt effect. The actually, they, they don't look too bad. Actually, the, the sentinel hands there. It's just a little bit different. Well, I just think because with the scale is, um, you know, with the scale, if you're going to have it next to a magnet or something like that, yeah. the hand is going to look off. Yeah, know, possibly. But if you put it then with something like maybe the Wolverine, the sideshow one, or some of the other well, stuff, no, the sideshow one is still. No, it's not big. Pause that. It's All not right. Big. Yeah, but anyway, we'll finish off on that one. Okay. And um, what we're next? Stop this. Yeah. Okay. Yo yo! Hope you enjoyed that. Um, uh, like, comment, subscribe, and share with everyone you know. Click the little bell. Become part of our uh, notification squad. And uh, if you are happen to be in Thailand, go check out this uh, wonderful shop. That uh, is it. Is it King Toys, is it Toy King? No, King Toys. TK, 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 yeah, go check it out because it looks crazy, it looks really slick. Huge thank you to uh, to Brian Tan for doing the video, uh, for TK for um, obviously opening up the store. Uh, ben for giving me a phone phone call this morning and going for a few what things. Time did he ring you? 6 a.m. Nice. I've been up since 6 a.m. because of Ben. You look like it. Somehow he kept on like overriding my messenger and his fucking. Uh, a uh, little video message kept popping up and I'm like you, dude man. I'm in bed <laughs> you know, I can't talk to you now I'm naked and I'm next to my girlfriend dude God, come give me five minutes please and um, also to saying as well we miss saying and uh, yeah, miss you what job all the other boys over in XM boys and girls uh, Alexa in you know um, and all the artists everyone there thanks keep Peace. up great work deuce bye bye